Hello everybody, my name is Abdurrahman Abdi and I will represent the Chinese company Huawei. So the class situation is, the, is that Huawei set to create 5G network and the US refuses that. So the trade war was uh, old since 2012 but the ban was effectively applied in 15 of May 2019 from President Trump against Huawei. So Huawei president has stated that the ban will happen sooner or later. So they are already working of an operating system by their own. So Huawei responds after the ban was Huawei has made substantial contribution to the development and growth of Android around the world. As one of the Android's key global partners, we have worked closely with their open source platforms to develop an ecosystem that has benefited both users and the industry. So Huawei will continue to provide security updates and after sales service services to all existing Huawei and Honor smartphone and tablet products covering those have been sold or still in stock globally. We will continue to build a safe and substantial software ecosystem in order to provide the best experience for all users globally. So I'm playing the role of uh, Huawei uh, CEO Ren Zhangfei and delivering a class briefing in the future of September or October 2019. My strategy about this situation is as a corporation, we may be able to convince our uh, economies to settle and negotiate and also use tranquility. So starting with my attention gather, yeah, uh, the, trade is, uh, the trade war is coming between the biggest nation in the trade world. So do uh, due to the unsuccessful trade talks, uh, Pre uh, President Trump decided to ban Chinese company Huawei. So technological firms within the U.S. have uh, been instructed uh, to stop uh, supplying their products to China-based uh, company Huawei also. So even before the ban, the U.S. increased the level of tariffs from 10% to 25% uh, to which China also prepared to retaliate. So it makes me quite upset to see that uh, because of the trade war, private companies, uh, especially those of uh, technological uh, nature, have to suffer. So retaliation is, however, uh, our only strategy in order to survive. So Huawei has worked hard in order to become one of the largest company and the world leading uh, competitors in technology and mobile services. So policymakers uh, need to understand that they cannot impose economic uh, sanction without accounting for the effect that it will have on the organization. So com companies globally, especially technological ones, support each other because we are dependent upon, e dependent upon each other. So not only uh, do trade wars uh, deteriorate uh, relation between economies, but the fur they further spew uh, hate between uh, countries and the public. So private organizations are effective, are effective more than anyone else who have uh, spent years in uh, researching and have invested massive amounts of money into technological innovation. Uh, I want to uh, be, I want to begin by uh, saying that I deeply regret the situation that we have come to, as no organization would uh, want to be affected by such economic decisions. So Huawei has captured a lot of uh, the global uh, market and without US companies supplying them without the technology, uh, their products might not be accepted uh, anywhere in the world. So, and bans will mean that revenues for both companies will fall down. So in addition, revenues of the te uh, telecommunication are accepted to fall quite a bit according to Banerjee. So China will eventually re uh, retaliate heavily and also ban all U.S. Uh, technological products according to several. So the rotation in, uh, is necessary due uh, to the fact that trade wars and the economy uh, demands it. So our consumers deserve better. We have come too far to stop. Uh, we need to compete provided our uh, current conditions. According to Leonard, uh, U.S. policymakers were imposing bans as uh, previously President Trump uh, revoked ban on Z uh, ZTE Corp. So also Leonard said that uh, we cannot rely upon uh, hope that negotiation will resume 
and so we will have to take place so around 50% of Huawei sales are global so Huawei is accepted to come up with their own softwares so Banerjee also mentioned that softwares are being developed by Huawei that will once again allow consumers to, to use Huawei like before so and the Chinese public is uh, already quitting US technological products which will lead to a lot of pressure upon uh, policymakers who may, who may want to reach the settlement so as I said before as a corporation we may be able to convince our economies to settle and negotiate so cooperation need to come together uh, to convince our policymakers and we want both uh, cooperation heads and policymakers to re uh, renegotiate again and end this trade war so so in conclusion the problem associated with the trade wars are highlighted so in order to save our own economy and uh, our our own economy and our com company certain harsh uh, steps in the form of uh, retaliation uh, are necessary but we want to move forward from this thank you for listening